Hi there and welcome to Panning with Kezia and this is the intro for the Four Seasons created by Jessica and Amanda over at the Fantastic Ladies. This is a project where you choose three items for each season of the year. So three for winter, for spring, for summer, for fall. So all in all over the year you will try to use up 12 products. From what I understand you don't actually need to wait to use all of those products. You can use them all during the whole year, I think. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do because I don't know any better. So let's just start. Let's start with winter, shall we? Because we're in the middle of it. So I'm going to use this bath bomb from Lush. This is called Snowball. And I like that it's actually looking like a snowball. It's not even or anything. But in the middle, I think it's actually blue. So it will give this really nice blue color in the bath. So I'm excited to use that. Next up, we have this body scrub from Boulevard. And I chose this because look at this. It really looks like snow or ice. I don't know if you can see all that shimmer. It looks like ice crystals. <laughs> so I chose that because that reminds me of winter. And then for the last product for winter, I chose this gold lip gloss. Now, I just want to remind you, if you didn't see my intro for this whole channel, I haven't used up a lot of makeup. I have used up one mascara. The other ones have gone bad, they've dried up or something. And I've decluttered a lot of things through these three years that I've been doing my makeup. But I've actually only finished up one makeup product. So I'm just trying to get myself in the game by using these small things. Um, also that will quickly reduce my inventory. So that's a huge plus. <laughs> so that was all for the winter. And then we come to spring. When I think of spring, I think of light colors, like pastel colors, I don't know why, but I think about spring cleaning. I think about freshness, you know? So first of all, from a repeat, we have the hand sanitizer. It's pretty small, I think it's 50 mils. Yeah, milliliters. Pretty small, but I need to remind myself to use it. So let's do it. Then we have from the same set, um, from Rituals, it's the Rice Milk and Cherry Blossom Home Perfume. And we also have in the same, <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this, <laughs> why? <laughs> um, but it's in the same scent. It's the Ritual of Sakura Flourishing Hair and Body Mist in the Cherry Blossom as well. And I really like them, but I have to think about using them. So those are the things for spring. Then we get to summer and it's hot and we want to just splash some water on our face. So here we have a face mist from The Body Shop. It's a vitamin C face mist. And we also have a sunscreen because the sun is coming out. Not always in Sweden, but, <laughs> but we want to. Uh, we want to have some sun here, so... Um, so that reminds me of summer, even though I know people say you should have it all year long and it's the most important thing ever, but it still makes me think about the sun and the sun makes me think about summer. So it's still a summery product to me. Also, when I hear tropical sun, this is a perfume. I really, really like the smell of this. I think it's from a real time. Um, I got it in an advent calendar and uh, yeah. I don't know how long it will take me to use this up, but I like the scent. So we'll see how long it takes me to finish this. Um, maybe I won't finish it. Who knows? I really try to vary the products, both because I don't want too many of the same things in these projects, but also because I want some that are very simple to finish because I still want to meet my goal of finishing 200 pro products, not projects, <laughs> products uh, this year but I still want to get progress on other things as well. So I'm, I'm trying to get a good balance between the two. Also, if you only have really easy products or really hard, I think it will be pretty, pretty boring <laughs> after a while. So that's what I'm trying to do, to not make it too easy or too hard on myself. And then we have fall. 
And when fall comes, darkness comes. It can be cozy, but it can also be really depressing. <laughs> and I get sleepy. I get so sleepy. So I have from Lush the Sleepy Body Lotion. I just discovered Lush. I bought their advent calendar and two other sets. So I'm just trying their things out right now. And so far I like almost everything. So that's good. They're also very fresh or they're made with fresh ingredients. So I want to use them up as quick as possible so they don't go bad. Speaking of fall, fall colors. Here we have, I actually wondered if I wanted to have this um, for like Christmas or winter because it is a metallic lipstick. I've never seen anything like this. This is my oldest makeup item, I think. Uh, it, this is from Lumina. It's the shade Love Story 83. I've never seen it. I tried to check it up on the web, like if anyone is selling this anymore. No, it's way too old, but I really like it and I don't have very much left. This is all there is, like I can't do anymore. So um, maybe I can finish it. I mean, I really like it and it's old, so it really needs to go. So I'm going to try to use it a lot. So the last product in this project is from The Bang Beauty. It looks like this. I think this, this was actually the first product I thought of when I, when I thought about fall or autumn, um, just because of that orange in the middle and the black. But I realized that all of these are black. I thought one of them were like a, a dark, was a dark green or something, but they're all black. So it's really weird, I think. It's weird that a palette has three of the same color. I think I got it in a subscription box. Most of the things I have uh, are actually from subscription boxes or advent calendars or Makeup Mecca or now Lush, but, <laughs> uh, but mostly from advent calendars and subscription boxes. This is the only thing I'm not trying to use up or even hit pan on. Um, I'm going to try to use this 10 times throughout the year just because they're really not my color scheme I can't use it every day. Also these shades that I could use every day I already have those shadows in my pan that palette So I'm really only interested in the black and orange and those are not colors I want to use every single day for like a month or two to hit pan on so I'm just going to try to use this palette 10 times to not overwhelm myself. Or maybe I should use it 12 times just to have it like, I have to use it once a month. Should I? Yeah, let's make it 12. <laughs> I have a 12 use, like I could use it all like in one month if I wanted to. But let's say 12 times just because it's fun and all the other things I will try to finish. So that's it for the intro of the four seasons. I really hope you enjoyed this video and that you want to follow along on this journey. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to and click that little notification bell if you want to follow along on this journey. I still have a lot of project intros coming your way and um, I'm looking forward to each and every one of them. So um, yeah, that's it. I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.